Logan? Matt? Is it me, or do you smell a whiff of condescension in this room? I smell a whiff of frickin' uh, shilling out of a product. That was a low blow by a low bro. <laughs> yeah, with that said, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our look at on Indie Pogo! A potential exclusive as of when this video goes up. Yeah, because actually this game isn't even out yet. I'm playing a Kickstarter demo because... Uh, a good old friend of mine is, or acquaintance rather, is the one that hosted the Kickstarter in the first place and actually commissioned me to do a few a few bits of artwork for this game. I'll go ahead and flash him right here, and we shall go to our Battle Coliseum. Yeah, nice Dreamland theme here with the star. Battle! Just, just to let you guys know, James got to officially draw Shovel Knight, Lilac and from Lilac. Freedom Planet, the bit And all these runner. people. Oh my oh. god, it is the Gungeon Bullet! Bullet the Gungeon kid. Bullet is playable? Well, not now, but he will be. Yeah, or at least yeah. later, he will be. Yeah. So, I... yeah, wait, we have a bunch of indie guys, like Tesla, Tesla Grad Kid, Shovel Knight, of course, because he has to be everywhere. I forget who uh -huh. he's from. Arcane, Arcane from Rise of Ar Aether? I'd like to do that game Little sooner dad. later. Lilac. Lilac. Velox of Velosa Spider. Oh, Viridian. Voltar. Voltar, whatever his name is. Yeah, I don't know these guys. Oh, well, and Zorb Zorb and Zorb I know Weltard is from, uh... Is from. Oh, oh well. Oh. I, I know that Weltard is from uh, Downwell, which is a, oh, really, that's a right. really cool game. I really love Downwell. Uh, James, oh, why does Shovel Knight have ants in his pants as well as Commander Video? <laughs> because the point of the game is to pogo like you can never pogo before. As so you we can never shut up each other in a whole yeah. bunch of indie stages. Yeah, just to let you guys know, this game is very, very much Smash Brothers. Flappy Bird, freaking hell! Yeah, there's a Flappy Bird stage. Oh, that's a Flappy Bird video. See that too. Rumbo. Oh, and Space Junction from Duck from Duck Game. Yep. Yeah. Oh, let's go to Flappy. Land. To Flappy, so Flappy Bird. Do 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 so, do do do. Explain to us how the game works. Well, basically, like like it's already been said before, it's Ooh. pretty much indie Smash Brothers. Oh, uh, you you're constantly jumping, but you do have a dedicated jump button if you want to j hop in midair. You also have a dedicated attack oh. button, Oops. and oh. damn it! <laughs> damn, damn you! Damn you! Oh, oh. Jesus! This computer's not letting up. No, he is not. But I shall fight back with ever so with ever ever exhilarating gusto. That nice. Okay, so there's a health meter. There is. So there's a health meter, there Ooh. is beating them outside of the- Oh nice, all these attacks oh, nice. are cool. This there's, is- so... Wow, this is cool. And they got permission yeah. from all these creators. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, they did. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, um, some other some other characters that they're gonna try getting into the game, which uh, they weren't on the character screen, but they have already announced, one of which was Gunvolt. Nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, sweet. I'll be down. All right. Nice. And they're also gonna try getting other superstars, like, say, um... Actually, let, let me look up the Kickstarter page real quick so I can show, tell you just exactly who they're planning to bring in. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Everyone's all happy for us. So, I, so yeah, it looks like you're constantly jumping. It does have the edge thing, like from Smash Bros. So it's not just PlayStation All Stars. Oh, super! The horn. And my super triumph. is the blue horn. The blue horn. The blue horn of triumph. Yes. Oh. Ho ho! Ho ho! Ho ho! <laughs> so that's how it goes, basically. Everyone has a bunch of combos. Next and is it's Lilac, basically kind of like I imagine. That indie, it's, it's like that. It, it, no. Nope. Or him. It's like that. It's like that indie card game again, kind of. Yeah, but yeah, other characters that they're planning on bringing in is the uh, kid from Mutant Muds. Um, again, the bullet, the bullet characters as you already saw. Um, there are they're gonna try getting the uh, duck character from the Duck Game. Um, let's see. Um, there's... Spark the Electric Jester. Picks the cat. Mm. The Rumbo characters, yeah, they're they're gonna try getting a whole bunch of people um, on here. Here's real quick, for the best. I just remembered one I remember hearing, but I want to make sure I'm right about it. What's the name of that one um, luchador f uh, guy again? Guac oh, oh, uh, it's Guacamelee, but Juan from Guacamelee. Juan? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can see that working. Yeah, I want. See. I want Juan from Wakamele in here. Wakamele is great. I, I do not see Juan in the cameo pool, so right now it's it remains to be seen if he'll ever well, be edited. Shantae? Uh, I think Shantae might be I a bit know, of a reach. Uh, Lo Lobro and, uh, one of the Lobros themselves did tell me they were going to try getting Shantae into the game, but um, whether that'll happen remains to be seen. Oh. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to say this right now, and if you want to... 
if you want to like pass a note on to the uh, ah! oh nice they have that they have hitting the screen if you want to pass it on to the developer i don't know but um thinking on it actually another character that i think would work really well especially since in her game she technically is hopping constantly all over the place uh the girl from necrodancer hmm. uh, oh oh uh, she she was listed Oh, cool. So she is oh, okay. Yeah. And yeah, don't that's, tell me nothing. That's actually a different direction than right. I thought you were going to take. I thought you were about to say, if you can give your friend a note. No, they're not playing a papyrus, and no, you can't voice him. No, I'm not doing that. I wouldn't, I wouldn't voice him. But no, but I was saying, like, but yeah, no, I was just thinking of her because, yeah, she does technically hop around constantly. She doesn't walk. Yeah, she, but, she well, to be, to be fair, she's, she, she's whoops. dedicated to the beat. Oh, so close. I guess I'll ask, since we can talk a little bit and start talking about the Kickstarter, why did they want to do uh, them constantly hopping? To make it, I assume it was pretty much their get- Oh, what I happened, Player 3? I think it's mainly because they wanted to, they wanted a joke on Indiegogo. Pretty much. That, and I think- Oh, nice. I think they mentioned they wanted to keep it more active or whatever. Sort of, yeah. Oh! Ooh. He's also Thank you, Zorbi. It's such a it's a sad sh sad shame though that Zorby's game is all is not uh, playable on current iOS devices. No. Uh, so I really want the Bulletin. And now we're, I'm gonna play as the Sarkid, who's actually a, a a previous creation of the Low Bros themselves. Nice. And yeah. Lockman. Lockman from Runbo, I think. Oh, that's no, so I, fishy. And fishy. Uh, I love how you jump with the his only arms. Character from these, like, Honestly, the only character out of these I immediately remember is the uh, Tesla Kid. Well, yeah, Tesla mm. Kid's awesome. Also, just gonna say, even though I know most people... Nice. Even though most people don't probably want... My guess is most people don't want to do it because no one wants to go through the effort of actually animating that. I wouldn't mind if we did something like this where we had Cuphead to kind of appear in the roster of indie characters. Oh, oh yeah, dude, Cuphead in this game would be freaking awesome. But no one but no one would want to fully animate like that. Wait, and wait. And to be fair, Cuphead would look kind of weird if it wasn't fully animated. Wait, 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 wait. Idea. Idea. Uh, -huh. uh Cuphead, like, this, if this game gets released on consoles... Cuphead for for an Xbox exclusive. Like, if they were to do exclusives, Cuphead for Xbox, uh, probably, uh, Shantae, Shantae for, Switch. For, for Nintendo. Yeah, Shantae for Nintendo, and who would be PlayStation? Uh, I'm sure Virus? Kratos. Uh, I was, uh, no, I was just, no, actually not Chris, I was actually also thinking Dustin Elysian Tale. Oh Maybe. yeah. Well, I should, it, it should be said though, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, oh, this game, this ba this game barely su su succeeded. Like, I think I think they were only able, to, uh, they were able to succeed Ooh. in getting one stretch goal, which was the which is ultimate co alternate costumes for all the characters. The one that was going to be after that were PS4 and Xbox One ports. That Dang. didn't get funded, unfortunately. Aww. Oh. And even then, did it like, did it like really like, it really took like, what was it like? I know Kermifer helped a lot with some of his stuff, wasn't it? Yeah, I, I do know that one one major factor as to how this uh, Kickstarter succeeded was through uh, Derek from Game Explain. He actually well, did a video too. on this game himself, and it got a lot of media oh attention to the point oh. where a lot of, a lot, it got a lot more backers. Shit. Nice, just in time. Doing yeah. That was close. <laughs> Boom. And but with that said, okay. ah, oh, oh, not your game was still fun. <laughs> Sorry, Tesla kid. Don't worry, kid. Your game was the best of those. Tesla grad is cool. I like how they did the yeah. okay, Now we to go it. to there Lilac. Go. Yeah. Hey, my preferred character in the game, now, Sash Lilac from Freedom Planet. There, there you go. You're playing as your waifu. Hey, he's playing all the characters that he drew. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Yeah. He yes. These are all the characters that he is commissioned Guys. to draw. Wait a minute. No regrets. Uh, there's that whiff of condescension again. <laughs> it seems <laughs> weird. So what is Arcane from? Because I never played that game. He is from Rivals of Aether, which is pretty... It's essentially uh, Smash Brothers of a, a sprite base. Oh, this is cool. So the platforms will change periodically with the color. Get off the gold. Yep. Get off the Ooh. orange. Get off so the yeah, Lilac pretty much plays exactly as she does in Freedom Planet. She's got her she got her cyclone. She's got her dragon boost, and she does she has a little uh, downward kick. Okay, so I, I guess I'll ask: Do they have any involvement from the developers working with them on this, like or like you know giving them insight, or are they really or is it really kind of a like we need a character? Yeah. Okay, cool. 
I think there might be some input from the other developers, but, um... Uh-oh. Ooh, Dragon Laser. Uh-oh. Ah! Oops. But, um, yeah. I assume there might be some input. Oh, the oh, money bags. You can coins. the gold bags. <laughs> nice. That was what a nice detail help all of it. They are the they are what active they are what fill up your super. Now I don't know how you get the coins currently, but um yeah. Okay. Now as far as I'm concerned, I don't know if this demo is readily available to the public, but again, I was able to get mine from the creators themselves, and that's how I'm able to show it to you guys. Yeah. Well, and I'm looks, totally it's... and I'm totally not going to con you into getting me. No, oh, don't say that. You can't what? say that on TV. You can't be known. You can't be <laughs> you recorded. Can't... I like how you say you can't say that on TV, despite the oh, fact boy. that we are. You know, not. What if I, what if I, what if I stream this to my television with I? Oh Ow. gosh, there goes my like. I don't know. It's possible. Anything's possible. The future. Oh gosh, run. So, um, the floor run. is literally oh. lava. Oh, there goes commander video. So, oh, what was oh. I gonna say? Um, um, I mean, I like, I'm liking the detail. Like, they actually did put a lot of effort into like keeping their yeah. like move sets canon, and the the stages uh, have like little like tricks and stuff to them. I was expecting to be just skins. I will admit though, some characters do work better than others. Like, I honestly can't get into Orkane for the life of me, even though he was my favorite character in Rivals of Aether. There we go. Oh well, it's it's the PlayStation. And Shovel Knight does take a little bit of getting used to, Ooh. but Lilac, damn. Well, Shovel Knight, okay, Lilac, how's that Commander Video 3 and... game? You have disappointed Charles Martinet for the last time. <laughs> Ow. Dang. But uh, yeah, I mean this game. I mean I'm. This is showing promise, and again, this is just this is a this is like an alpha version technically. Yeah, this is a, this is a pre-alpha version, and I mean it's a pretty good one though. Even even though. I was able to figure out what the, the like the music they were using is from Isbot, and uh, some of the sound effects do remind me an awful lot of Kirby. But goddamn, it really like what they showed off. Otherwise, it's it's looking really good so far, and I'm hoping for the best. Right. But um, and it could be placeholder stuff. Yeah. With that said, though, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for our look at on the, in the Indiegogo Kickstarter demo for PC. And, yeah, Indie. Excuse me, Kickstarter. <laughs> the, <laughs> Whatever. The, Indie, the Indiegogo uh, Pogue Starter. Yes. <laughs> but yeah, like, um, shit, I don't even know what I can say anymore. I'm just, just <laughs> speechless. Uh, see you guys later. Bye bye. Bye. Po go 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 away. No, 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 no. Indiegogo stick starter. Bye.